out of Denver um, we're heading to Vail to go see some aspen trees if you didn't know there's such thing as an aspen tree and that's how they got the name aspen. <laughs> who'd you learn that from so I taught Lola something and Kaylee absolutely hates it Lola load up Lola Lola load up yes that's something that I learned from the ranch manager in Montana, and that's what he would say when he wanted his pup to get up on the ATV. And now that's how Lola knows. <laughs> it's time to get on the couch and we're heading out of here. We got all the trees starting to change colors. We got this beautiful river down here. The air up here is so thin. I was thinking about going for a run later, but I don't even know how I'm gonna do it. It's crazy. We're up at 9,000 feet, and uh, you run around for a second, you're out of breath. Hello, YouTubers. I just want to give you a public service announcement that these glasses are fake. I only bought them because I want to look super extra intelligent for you YouTube viewers out there. <laughs> <laughs> so we're in Vail. It's freaking amazing here. We're going to get a beer. At a bar. At a bar. And we're going to go watch the Pats. Aren't you go excited? football. Kaylee only watched one football game in her life. That's not true. Yes, I've only watched true. one football game entirely. And it was the Super Bowl last year when the Patriots had like the best comeback of all time. And afterwards she was like, yeah, football's kind of cool. But I should start watching this. And uh, I made up all the rules so she doesn't really know how football That's works. That's freaking no. I told her that the bullseyes on the orange poles on the sidelines are two points. And then if you hit the yellow pole, the flagpole, if you hit the yellow pole, then you get three points. So as far as she knows, that's all she knows about football. I didn't believe him the second he said that. So we just got back a little while ago. Jordan and I had a little date night in downtown Vail Village which is probably one of the coolest places that I've ever been to. The best way I can compare it to is the North Pole. And yes, I've been there before. We went to this bar called The Remedy, which was a little fancier than we expected, but we wanted to watch the football game and they had a special going on for $15 for all you can eat chicken wings. And yes, we do eat mostly plant-based, but we were craving chicken. And you just gotta live life. like. We're not going to restrict ourselves from the We don't regret it at all. It was so good. Yeah, we don't regret it. Now we're posted up back in the bus and we're getting ready for bed. We got our cozies on. We got our little heater going. And of course... We got the Lola Cuddles. We got the Lola Cuddles. She's so cozy. So we're going to hit the sack early tonight. We're going on a hike early tomorrow morning uh, with some friends out here. So... We'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> So we just finished breakfast. Our friends just arrived. We are going for a little like three, four mile hike and we'll see you guys up there. How the f did we end up here? <laughs> Freaking snow it! <laughs> We've 
nibbly up here. Definitely don't wear the right shoes. They're soaked all the way through. These people from Colorado are out of their minds. Well, this is the top, but you can't see anything. We're in a snowstorm. We're heading back down, it's freezing. The three females made their way down the icy path. Woo! Slip after slip, toe over heel. They crossed the narrow river and made one step closer to warmth and survival. So we just got back to the bus and uh, we're defrosting right now. It was freaking freezing. It was a blizzard out there! We got stuck in a snowstorm. 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 We got stuck in a snowstorm and didn't have the proper clothes mm -hmm. at all. I only had this and running shoes and it definitely wasn't enough. We were freezing. I guess the view was supposed to be amazing, but um, it was, we were snowed in. This little nugget was having a blast though. So. <laughs> she was, she was having such a good time. We're gonna cook some dinner now. Kaylee's been on this taco binge and all she wants is tacos. We're gonna make tacos. <laughs> and um, that's about it. That's about it. Peace. <laughs>